Welcome to English Language Questions and Answers. Let's see today's topic. I am a teacher. But outside of work, I am a language learner too. Having studied three languages, I know that sometimes the simplest words can be the most elusive. Today's question Hello. I would like to know when to use well or good. Hi. I hope you're doing well. Today is a good day to learn English. I wonder if you followed how I used the words well and good. In the first sentence, well describes the verb doing. In the second, good describes the noun day. Well is an adverb. Like many adverbs, well describes the way that something is done. Well answers the question, how? Good is an adjective. We use it to describe nouns. So, we can say Valentina is a good singer. We used good to describe the singer. And we can say Valentina sings well. We used well to describe how Valentina sings. This sounds simple, right? But there are a few rules that do not follow this formula. Rule number one use good for the five senses sight, taste, smell, touch, and sound. Listen to a few examples. The holiday meal tasted so good. What is that perfume? It smells good. This bed feels good. It is so soft. Sense verbs are linking verbs. We use good with other linking verbs, such as seem and appear. Rule number two to talk about physical health, use well. Let's hear examples. I do not feel well. I think I should see a doctor. You don't look well. How are you feeling? Rule number three To talk about an emotional state, use good. I felt good when I finally completed the program. He feels good about helping his mother. So, how do you answer the common question, how are you? In American spoken English, we usually answer, I'm good, or just good. But if you would like to be a little more formal, you can say, I'm well, or I'm doing well. Lastly, the comparative and superlative words for well and good are better and best. <laughs> 